Good day everyone! Today we will be talking about population explosion. In the times of uncertainty, as parents, you just want the best for us, your children. And I know that there's something you want for us to be when we grow up. I know you want us to be a doctor, teacher, engineer, and any professions that you know that could make our lives stable. But sadly speaking, everything you wanted for us to be can be 100% come true if there are issues like population explosion. But how does the increase in the population or population explosion as what they call affects the future of us? The cause of the population explosion includes many factors in essence. This includes number one, increase in the birth rate. Due to the lack of control and delivery and unawareness of people, the birth rate is increasing rapidly. And now that everyone is at home, there is a high chance and time to make a new one. Number two, decrease in infant and mortality rate. It refers to the number of death of infants below the age of six months. Number three is the high level of illiteracy rate. Due to the lack of education, people doesn't know anything about family planning and sex education. Those three things cause the population explosion which generates many issues in the country that cause many problems for people. Number one, unemployment. Due to the increase in the population, the demand for jobs and employment also increases. But due to the lack of resources and employment opportunities, there are millions of Filipinos are unemployed. Number two, poverty. Due to the large population, there are a large number of people who belong to below the poverty line and they do not have adequate knowledge in the overpopulation of the country. Also, they are the reason or the major contributor to a high birth rate. However, there are various methods which we can prevent a population explosion. And here are four of them. Number one, empower women. Study shows that women with access to reproductive health services find it easier to break out of poverty, while those who work are more likely to use birth control. Number two, promote family planning. Simply educating men and women about contraception can have a big impact. Number three, basic education for children. Children are the people of tomorrow. We could start the change if we teach them at the young age the importance of education. Number four, livelihood seminars. It could create job opportunities for many of the Filipinos. If in the family, at least one of them has job, they could provide the family's basic needs and rights, like having the capability of sending their children the school. That's why I initiate a campaign that could help to solve some of the effects of the population explosion and this campaign is titled as Bata Bata Paano Ka Ginawa? This campaign envisions all of the citizens of the Philippines to become an example of having the social and moral mindedness by educating all of the Filipinas about women empowerment family planning, livelihood skills, and ed basic education for children that could lift up our lives. And this is open for all of the parents, teenagers, and out-of-school youth who wants to make their life more meaningful, much better, and wants to start a change for ourselves, for our families, and for our society. For knowing all of the causes and effects that population explosion brings in our country, do we think we could achieve our dreams? Or your dreams for us? If we are part of the poorest of the poor, if our parents are one of those people who are unemployed, 
being in this kind of situation, it is better for us to stop going to school and start helping our parents, our family. We have dreams that we want to achieve. Let us all help each other achieving those by starting to become a responsible citizen.